Jeopardy! Introducing today's contestants. The far left, we have Mr. Keenan, an American government and world history teacher here at North Hills. In the middle, we have Air Dival, a German teacher here at North Hills. And on the far right, we have Mrs. De Pasquale, our returning champion, whose previous winnings totaled $3,950. I'm your host, Andrew Bench, and let's get into today's categories. We have State the National Monument. All answers are the names of states. Who writes the songs? Game time. U.S. history. Which continent? All answers are continents. And Beatlemania. Miss D, you have the board. Okay, let's do game time for 400. It's the board game in which you could be ordered to go directly to jail. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. <laughs> Air Dival. What is Monopoly? That is correct. Uh, which continent for 400, please? It's the largest desert in the world. What is the Sahara Desert? That is incorrect. Ooh. Mr. Keenan. What is Asia? That is also incorrect. Oh. The correct answer okay, is okay. what is Antarctica? Oh, oh. yes. Yeah. Oh, well, that was a good one. Am I still in control of the board then? Yes. Right, Let's go which continent for 100. Is the birthplace of Western civilization, Mr. Keenan? What is Europe? That is correct. Still uh, let's try, uh, we'll go easy on these guys. Game time for 500. One of the four board games invented in the 20th century that are in the National Toy Hall of Fame. Mr. Keenan. Uh, what is Monopoly? That is correct. Mr. Keenan, you have the board. Uh, I will take, uh, let's do U.S. history for 200. This couple were the only United States civilians ever executed in America for espionage. Mr. Keenan. Uh, who are Sacco and Vanzetti? That is incorrect. The correct answer was who are the Rosenbergs? Mm. Mr. Keenan, still you. Uh, who writes the songs for 400? This country singer-songwriter was on the road again as a door-to-door -door encyclopedia salesman. Who was Willie Nelson? That is correct. You have the board. Uh, let's go who writes the songs for 300. He wrote the songs Copacabana and Could It Be Magic, but not I Write the Songs. <clears throat> Air Dibble. Who is uh, Barry Manilow? That is correct. Thank you. <laughs> Big fan. Uh, who writes the songs for 100, please? The 2016 Nobel Literature Prize went to this American singer and songwriter. The correct answer is, who is Bob Dylan? Oh, okay. Uh -huh. well, that's a good choice. That? Good choice. You still have the board air dial. Uh, who writes the songs for 200, please? The last remaining member of a three-man group shares the records for the most consecutive Billboard Hot 100 number ones with six. The correct answer is who is Barry Gibb. Oh, okay. Of the Bee Gees. You still have the board. Let's go who writes the songs for 500. This double fantasy songwriter was said to be legally blind without his glasses, Air Dival. Who is Stevie Wonder? I lost that is picture. incorrect. I knew it. Any guesses? Who is John Lennon? Oh, well, wow. there we go. Still in control of the board, huh? Yes. Uh, let's go with which con in for five bills. Is the second largest in area and population. <laughs> Mr. Keenan. What is Africa? That is correct. You have the board, Mr. Keenan. Uh, let's do which continent for 300? And that is our daily double. And what would you like to wager? Uh, I'll wager all of it. All right. Is the birthplace of most of the world's major religions? What is Asia? 
That is correct. Ms. McKeenan, you have the board. Uh, let's do Beatlemania for 400. The Beatles' alliterative nickname. Ms. D. The Fab Four. What is the Fab Four? That is correct. Ms. D, you are on the board and you have control of the board. Uh, let's do Beatlemania for 400. We just did that one. Uh, let's do it for 500. All right. The man playing the guitar solo on While My Guitar Gently Weeps wasn't a Beatle, but this guitar god. Air Dibel? Oh, uh, who's Eric Clapton? That is correct. Of course it is. <laughs> yeah. It's like the one answer I know. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go, um, let's go with, uh, let's go with State the National Monument for Honors. George Washington Birthplace. Ms. D. Uh, what is Virginia? That is correct. Ms. D, you have the board. Uh, let's do State the National Monument for 500. Oregon Pipe Cactus and Navajo. Ms. D. What is Arizona? That is correct. You still have control of the board. Uh, state, and na state the National Monument for 400. Little Bighorn Battlefield. Ms. D. What is Oklahoma? That is incorrect. Air Dibel. What is North Carolina? That is incorrect. Oh. Mr. Keenan. What is North Dakota? That is incorrect. The correct answer is what is Montana? Oh, jeez. <laughs> I knew it was one of them. Very close. He's close. He's close. It's all the same. <laughs> it's right next door. Come yeah, right. I mean, it's. Miss D is still the board. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, let's do uh, game time. All right, we'll do 400. All right. A version of this popular board game was played in India over 1,500 years ago. Air Dival. What is chess? That is incorrect. Ms. D. What is Mahjong? That is incorrect. <laughs> Not even going to try. The correct answer is scramble. what is Parcheesi? Oh, uh, I was just thinking Scrabble. It was said earlier. Yeah, I said Parcheesi, Mahjong, aren't they Ms. D, the same? you still have the board. <laughs> okay, uh, let's take U.S. history for 400. That's right, I'm coming at you. Bring it. This forward <laughs> motto saying watch your step was on many early American flags. Mr. Keenan. Uh, don't tread on me. What is don't tread on me? That is correct. <clears throat> Mr. Keenan, you have the board. Uh, U.S. history for five. At a woman's convention in Ohio in 1851, this former slave delivered her Ain't I a Woman speech. The correct answer is who is Sojourner Truth? in that one history. <laughs> Mr. Keenan, you still just hold on to my lead. I know. You give me uh, give me which continent for three. Is home to the country that produces the most coffee. Fix. Mr. Keenan. Uh, what is South America? That is correct. You still have the board. Uh, uh, let's do state the national monument for three. White Sands. Dibble. What is New York? That is incorrect. That's by Plains. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I can't win. <laughs> Miss D. I'll try it. What is California? That is incorrect. Oh. Want to take a gander? No. No? The correct answer is what is New Mexico? Oh. Okay. There you go. Oh, that was wow. your guess a while ago. <laughs> Mr. Keenan still is the board. Uh, Beatlemania for two. This beetle was known as the quiet one. Ms. D. Who is George Harrison? That is correct. Ms. D, you have the board. Uh, let's do which continent for 300? We already did that one. Oh, well That's then let's the do Beatlemania for 100. Okay, and we'll finish off the category. The Ringo Starr's real name. I know this. Oh my goodness. Oh, I know this. I can't stand it. <laughs> The correct answer is, who is Richard Starkey? Yes. Ms. D, you still have the board. Okay, how about State the National Monument for 200? Muir Woods. Mr. Keenan. What is California? That is correct. 
you, the board. Uh, let's do U.S. history for one. Reconstruction was the 13-year period following this war. Ms. D. What is the Civil War? That is correct. That's right, history teacher. And just because you got a faster buzz. Okay. Uh, let's do game time for 200. All right. The object of this game with a four-letter name is to occupy every country and thus conquer the world. Mr. Keenan. What is risk? That is correct. Let's do U.S. history for three. The only constitutional amendment to be repealed, the 18th Amendment originally put this into effect. Ms. D. Oh, geez. What is prohibition? That is correct. And we are down to the last one. Game time for 100. Okay. The weapons in this board game are a rope, a lead pipe, a knife, a wrench, a candlestick, and a revolver. Air Dibble. What is Clue? That is correct. And with that, we finish off the board, and we are going to move on to Final Jeopardy. Ooh. Not this okay. I I'll wager it all. Let's You're go. not supposed to tell. Oh, I thought you were supposed to tell. No, you can't tell no, the rest I mean, of I'll, I'm only going to wager a little well, bit. I, I don't know. I'll, I'll do Miss D by one dollar. You don't have to tell me yet. Okay, no worries. Just have it in your head. I'm just thinking. I don't even know what I'm talking And the question is, in the 1870s, this invention made John W. Gates a millionaire and closed off the open range. You have 30 seconds. What did you say? Closed off the open range? In the 1870s, this invention made John W. Gates a millionaire and closed off the open range. $1,601 and wrote down what is barbed wire. That is correct. Fish. Dang you. And that puts you <laughs> and at. And I can do math. That, I didn't even try. That puts you at $3,301. Before you read my answer, I'd like to protest. I think the cyclone <laughs> fence is as close as you can get to barbed wire. I'm just throwing it out there. Did you put a fence too? Puts Air dive correct. wagered at all. Yes. And you, you, you said, what is the cyclone fence? That is incorrect. Although the tops of cyclone fences are rally Barbie, you know, they like those little like barb things. But okay, I'll, I'll respect the game. The no, I respect the process. Thing? Is that this thing? Yeah, like no, the, this yeah. thing. Yeah. Yeah. This yeah. thing. Yeah. Which, yeah. I said the railroad. Miss D. I, it, I, I didn't read it yet. Oh, sorry. Jeez. You wagered it all. And you answered, what is the railroad? And that yeah. is incorrect. Yeah. Do you get my logic, though? Yes. It cut off the range? Unfortunately, the, the range? logic was wrong. Get it? I, I could see how, how someone might make that. Yeah, right? That connection. That is the end of our but show. <laughs> Mr. Keenan is the new champion with $3,301. Oh, Choke on it, Mr. Keenan. We love you. <laughs> Thank you all for playing. <laughs> now, we need a moment to actually, I need to get your scores. Okay. Yes. And so you can wager. Well, what's the score? What do the gonna, scores look like in there, people? Do I have any points? Million. <laughs> do I have any positive points, Olaf? Oh, good. Let's bet them all then. Pull a Carmen Washington. I would like to bet 37 million. <laughs> you have 300. That's right. I'm going to wager. I'm going to wager Tom Lissack's pant size. <laughs> I'll wager Mr. Lissack's pant size. <laughs> I have sawdust all over me. These are like legit. What are yeah. these? Hey, that's it's like it's a little library desk or something. Trash. <laughs> are you listening to me? Can you hear me? That that gave me a great idea. We should do we should do a clue, like a whole clue event. Like a murder mystery event here. Hair diable with his bare evening. hands in the hallway. <laughs> the, the yeah, you can just walk around real creepy. Yeah. Like hair diable. <laughs> How would that be different from any other day? That's what I'm saying. Well, actually, but it's, it's, you're murdering someone, so it's like, you know, beating to death with your bare hands in the hallway. I'm going to tell you how much I'm doing. Do we have to write it down here or something? I'm going to tell you how much I'm doing. Would you like to write it down? No, I... I'm going to tell, is it on the, gonna tell the people on the microphone what I'm doing. I didn't wager anything, like... 46. Yeah, we'll write it down. 
They heard me. I can whisper it. I whispered it to them. They heard me. Luckily, we can edit. I will wager everything that I have. I know a few thousand points. I'm not sure. Don't do like 3,500 because I only have 3,000. A copy of something ending in the word off. Facsimile. No, Carmen, it's knockoff. <laughs> My favorite. Thank you. The camera cuts away as Maddie screams horrifically. <laughs> Sophie, Joe, and Connor run from the car towards right the park. Your wager and the what answer the to the question the once. Oh, and the answer. Time's up. I'm glad this wasn't skewed in any way. Thanks, Andrew, for all the science questions. I'd like to thank Andrew for all the science the questions. <laughs> Again, Olaf, props on the science questions. Way to be. Thank you. I wrote the questions thank and you, they Andrew. Were not science. <laughs> Well, they were not science. I know I'm being sarcastic if you can't tell. <laughs> She's just bitter. I am bitter. The fix was in. Don't mess with the founder of the history. No.